Hey, hey, hey. I tried to take Cardboard Jesus' you know, intro, but I, I couldn't go through with it. He does it way too amazing. What's up, everybody? Cardboard Moses with you. Welcome. It is time to do another break uh, for eBay. We're going to be doing, uh, what is it, 2017-18? Yes, it is. Panini NBA Hoops Basketball. Five box uh, quarter case break. There's so many boxes in a case that we uh, we split it into quarters, y'all. That's 25% out of a dollar. You get four quarters, what do you get? You get a whole dollar or a whole case. I don't know what I'm trying to do there. Anyways, this is break number two, so that means we already did one of them. Uh, so let's get to the second part of this case. Oh, I'm fully aware of the Timberwolves, uh, Jerry. I don't know if that was your uh, attempt at sarcasm, but uh, you can do better. You can do better. Good luck, everybody. Oh, so it looks like your batteries have been replaced. You sound a little bit better, uh, Abraham. All right, so I see some requests up in this thing. I mean, I always tell people, you know, if you got a request, if you want me to pull a team, you got to let me know. Otherwise, I'm just going to pull things that I think are hot. But if you want your hit, you got to request it. That gerbil is everything, Matt. That gerbil is everything. I'm not sure if it's a gerbil or maybe it's like a little mini panda. I'm, I'm still not quite certain what I want to, you know, label it. Because once I label it something, that's it's, it's stuck. It's, you know, that's what it is. So I don't want to commit to anything, you know. It's either a gerbil or a hamster or a mini panda. So you got you got to think outside the box here. How many talking gerbils or hamsters do you know? Exactly. Therefore, you got to, you know, at the very least, consider the possibility that it might be a mini talking panda. Uh, any word on the NT? I do not, Kyle. I have not received the word on it. I mean, I already talked to Gelf about getting me a case. Uh, I'm just not sure when it's going to arrive. Uh, and honestly, Kyle, I already have a list of everyone in that break. So if you need a, a refund or anything like that, let me know, man. And I will uh, hop on that. You know, I don't want to keep you waiting what's it been, like, almost two weeks now? Something ridiculous like that, so I completely understand. You can put that money towards something else. And if I do get the, N you know, if and when I do get the NT Baseball, I'll do something funky with it. Uh, what's wrong with the Warriors? I have no idea what's, what's wrong with them. I know the Heat play them later on tonight, so maybe that's what's wrong with them. Uh, the Heat are a really, really, really good team, and nobody's talking about us. And I, I, I like it that way. I, honestly, I do. You're gonna write it out, Kyle. That's what she said. <laughs> hey! Honestly, I haven't seen much Warriors. Uh, many Warrior games, I should say. I honestly really only watch the Heat. Uh, I, every now and then I'll watch other teams. You know, the big teams, of course, you got to watch. The Cavaliers are boring as hell to watch. It's LeBron playing out by himself out there, so that's actually kind of sad. Uh, Magic are playing pretty good basketball. That's another team no one's really talking about, the Magic. Uh, Aaron, that, who's that? What's his name? Aaron Gordon? I'm not sure if it's Aaron Gordon or Aaron something. But he's been balling. Yeah, I saw that one-on-one -on -one pull for archives. Chris Bryant, uh, my homeboy, Cardboard Jesus, pulled that thing last night. What it do, Chris Fitz? Uh, I was actually here when he pulled it. Uh, it's just, it wasn't me. All right, let's get to the hoops. All right, so we got some uh, refractor action. All right, these should be a lot better to, to you know to sort as opposed to doing you know a whole case worth of this thing which takes literally four hours it's not fun that's why we've been a little backed up with the shipping but we have pretty much caught up honestly 
Sorters have done a really good job of catching up. Kyrie Irving of the Celtics to 199. Very nice. Celtics have actually been playing really good ball too. I think they lead the league in uh in defense. Got an auto here for the Clippers, one of the best teams in the league right now as well. Cindarius Thornwell is the auto. Let's move this back a little bit. Now what do we have here for the Spurs? A little refractor for Kawhi. Got an auto up here for one of the best big men in the league. Joel Embiid. That's a nice card. And he kept the autograph, well, for the most part, all on the sticker. Pretty nice. Good job, Embiid. High five, big guy. It's not numbered, but still, very nice. Very nice. Now, right, let's continue here. Put a little that. Put that to the side. Put that to the side. There's some nice stuff in hoops, man. Uh, the only, honestly, the only issue with hoops is just the amount of base. You could start a serious forest fire. Avery Bradley to a 999 there for the Cavs. I'm going to actually take time to, you know, sleeve the numbered cards and whatnot this go around. Because uh, it's not going to take me a whole freaking three and a half hours to do so. So, yeah. Blake Griffin there for the Clippers. I know the, uh, what time is that game? I think it's starting like in an hour or so, the Green the Green Bay game. Not that it matters because my boy uh, Aaron Rodgers is out for the season. So uh, that sucks. That would be a sweet auto to have, Allen Iverson. That's my favorite player all time, in case anybody's wondering. Ben Simmons, the, the rookie of the year right now, honestly. He's been killing it. For the Warriors, number to 2017. That's kind of crazy. John Wall. Right there, right there. Larry Nance, special delivery insert right there. Uh, everything but ba uh, veteran base. Yes, sir. You are correct, the Mundo, Matt. Because, you know, it's just way too much base, man. Kemba Walker. Yeah, Whiteside's been, been killing it. He's He's been uh, battling some injuries. But when he is playing, he's been uh, an absolute monster. Jameis uh, Johnson to 199 for the Heat, baby. What determines veteran base uh, if it looks like this? If you're Jamal Crawford, you're a veteran. Basically, if you're not a rookie and it's a base card, it doesn't get shipped. But if it's an insert, you know, then it does ship. Like this would be considered an insert. This would be the base set. And this would also be an insert. The 2017 Kyle Lowry of the Raptors. See, that's a, that's a base, but that's a rookie, so that goes, you know. Isaiah Whitehead for the Nets to 99. So those are little, uh, I call them prism. They kind of remind me of like a prism or something, like a kaleidoscope kind of. That's a cool little design they got on. We got two autos out of that box. Yeah, I think that's uh that's actually pretty on the ball, uh, Matt. I believe that is what we do. This is box numero dos. 
so many packs. 24 to be exact. What's up, Gingerbread Will? Phoenix is not till 9 o'clock. Well, listen, Misha, you know, nobody's... It's, it's all good, you know? I'm not putting a gun to your head and saying, Hey, bid, motherfucker, bid! I'm not, you know, I'm never going to tell you to, to bet on something you don't want. But I will say this, you get what you pay for. So if $5 is your limit, you know, I wouldn't expect anything more than $5 in return, you know. This is, after all, gambling, so... The higher the risk, the higher the reward. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying. I'm just wasting time so I can open packs. All right, here we go. Well, then, be uh, be prepared to be pissed off, Misha, because uh, just because you put it out there, I'm going to pull it. Watch. If I do that, I'm going to go play the lottery. Or maybe I'm Jesus. That'd be kind of It'd be kind of weird. This is an insert for Kyrie Irving. The Celtics right there. Well, there you go, Matt. As long as you're happy, I'm happy. That's that's what I require for, uh, for sustenance. Your happiness feeds me. Dwayne Bacon. Speaking of uh, feeding, there's the bacon for the Hornets. Autograph. Well, there you go, Marty Mar. See? A happy dude. What it do, Ken's dad? How about them Canes, man? Listen, after, I'm going to talk about this. I'm, I'm going to talk about my Hurricanes right after this break because I don't want to put my... Put, 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 it, this video is going to be on YouTube at some point, so I don't want to get bashed for it, for, for what I'm about to... I'm about to go off on the Canes. To 189 for the Kings, Harry Giles. Now go off on the Canes. I worded that terribly. More so on what the people are saying about the Canes, which is absolutely ridiculous. And it's only right considering, uh, you know, who we play this upcoming weekend. We do play Notre Dame. DeMar DeRozan for the Raptors to 2017. I was trying to get tickets to go, and then my homie hit me up, and he's like, yo, what you doing for the game? And I'm like, shit, trying to go. And he was like, good luck, bruh. And I was like, why? And he was like, dog, to sit in the nosebleeds is like $200. And I was like, shit, I guess I'm going to stay my ass home. Because I'll be damned. i pay $200 to sit in the nosebleeds. And we take an L, dog? No, thank you. D'Angelo Russell for the Nets. I mean, truth be told, the Notre Dame, uh, whatever they are, they got a good team out there. That's a good player for the Nets, though. That's a nice auto. That NBA Hoops backstage pants. Robert Covington, Sixers insert. Yeah, D'Angelo Russell is doing his thing. He's doing his thing. I'm not really upset at the Kings, though. We're killing it, honestly. We, I really thought that Virginia Tech game was going to be a lot closer than it was. Quite honestly, the Hurricanes spanked them, boys. We really did. 
Um, I'm not sure if those rankings are weekly. But if we're not in the top six after that, or top eight, there's something wrong with that committee. Uh, Kelly Olenek to 999 for the Celtics right there. Although he played for the Heat now. But that'll go to the... I think that goes to the Celtics. Celtics, uh, yes sir. To 25, Tony Bradley. That is nice. That goes to the Jaws. Uh, yeah, if we beat Notre Dame, we're definitely top five. Um, but I'm not really worried about Notre Dame. I'm more so concerned about, like, the committee or whatever. Because uh, just what I've been hearing about what they're talking about, the, uh, the you know, they're calling us thugs again and uh, all types of other colorful language. And uh, that's not really cool, man. The, the, those boys are, like, legitimately balling. You know, they got a tight group. They're like a family, and people are calling them thugs and shit because they like to rock the chain. Y'all hating on the chain? Hating on the turnover chain, dog? If y'all so mad, don't turn the ball over. We ain't going to rock it. You know what I'm saying? But, yeah, man, it's, that's not cool, man. People calling us thugs. Like, and none of those kids have, have ever done anything to warrant being called thugs. You know what I'm saying? So, that's just my two cents. Gordon Hayward to 2017 for the Jaws. Because at the time he was playing for the Jazz. That's it for the second box. I don't know. I feel like they threw the... Uh, those Shaq cards in, because, you know, Kobe Bryant has the uh, his inserts, the Kobe Bryant career inserts or whatever. Uh, and I felt like Shaq was like, yo, let me get my uh, let me get my 2K inserts in there because Kobe Bryant has his inserts in, and I want some inserts in there. I want Cardboard Moses to have a terrible time sorting this. And that's, and that's how, kind of how that went down. That was my Shaquille O'Neal impression. It's not the best, but I think I get the point across. We're not beating Notre Dame. Oh, damn. Uh, what's the name? John Dewitt? John Devitt. I apologize. Uh, Johnny Boy. I will see you on Monday, sir. When we whip that ass. That's the beautiful thing about college football, or just sports in general, is anybody can win on any given, you know, day. Doesn't matter if you have the best team, money can buy. Every dog does have his day. Josh Adams, I don't know who that is. You know, if he's not a hurricane, <laughs> it don't matter, baby. Seriously, though, are they going to, like, update the rankings for the week? You know what, Keem's dad? That's why. That's why we are. Uh, that's why we're best friends. Oh, he's a Heisman candidate running back for the Irish. Oh, that's cute. That's a big game, man. If the Hurricanes can beat them, and you know, do well against uh, what's his name, Josh Adams. I'll be honest. Honestly, I, I really didn't know who he was. I wasn't trying to be like a, you know, sarcastic or anything. I honestly did not know. Uh, I really don't pay attention to any other players aside from, like, the Hurricanes. Ah, there you go, kid. Well, yeah, man, if it ain't a bear, I don't care. And, I'm, and I feel the same way about the Heat and Dolphins. Uh, 
I would like to be a Marlins fan, but uh, I can't. I can't handle the heartbreak. They put Canes number seven. A. Oh damn! Really, John? Nice. I'm gonna have to look at the uh, at Notre Dame's schedule and see exactly who they've played. I will say this though: Georgia Bulldogs are doing it. Although they came, they had a little scare this past weekend. You can't lie. You can't lie. Number six in the coaches poll. I pay more attention to the coaches poll than I would the nation, you know, the people's poll or whatever. Let's get through this thing. Evan Fournier for the Magic to 199. They're having a good season so far. I mean, we're only, what, like, what, 10, 11 games in, but off to a good start. Ah, John, so it's in the DNA. It is in the DNA. So, uh, so if the Hurricanes can hold them to, like, 20 yards rushing... So much for his uh, Heisman hopes, huh? I probably just jinxed it. Watch him go off for like 300 yards in one quarter. Well, listen, the Mavericks Mavericks have a good deal in Dennis Smith Jr., man. That kid is going to be sick. Draymond Green to 2017 for the Warriors. John Wall to 2017 for the Wizards. For the Raptors, OG Anunobi with the auto. That's a nice card for the Raptors. He was a nice player out there for Indiana back in his college days. Stephen Curry for the Warriors to 199. Not sure what the Warriors record is, but uh, you know they're probably suffering from uh, post championship nostalgia. Like yo, you remember that? You know, you remember when we shitted on LeBron and them dog? Yeah, I remember that dog. I know we just lost, but you know, we the champs though. Obi-Wan Kenobi. I like that. Uh, although that's not what I said. But that should be his nickname. OG Anunobi is his name. Kind of kind of goes with uh, Obi-Wan Kenobi. So what should we call him? We should, we should just call, call him OG Kenobi. Hey. That's what I'm going to call the Jedi. He's a Jedi now. For the Hornets, Marcus Page. With the autograph. I believe that's the second Hornets auto. Mendaugas Kuzminskis for the Knicks. The Knicks are just, you know, signing pretty much anybody with a difficult last name to, to pronounce. That is signed to 25. 25 out of 25. That's an eBay 101, y'all. 15 of the Shacks. Yeah, those Shaq uh, inserts are uh, hilarious. Cal Lowry, Raptors. The 2017. for that box. That was box number three. What time is the Lions game? I have no clue, man. I think it's like in, in 30 minutes or so. 
eight eight thirty maybe. I don't know. At eight thirty says the fits clutch. Well, you should be happy, Misha. I would be happy too. Uh, no Malik Monks yet, CC5. Malik Monk is what, a Hornet? We've had two Hornet autos so far, but not Malik Monk. Eastern Standard Time. That's always crucial to let them know, Chris Fitz, you know? Because uh, we, we international, homie. We got all kind of time zones up in this piece. Immaculate did nice last night. Very nice. Might have to do some of that mo on the internet, babe. I'm glad it did good, because otherwise... <sighs> Notice them. Actually, I'm, I'm looking forward to tonight's game. The Heat and the Warriors, baby. Remember when Dallas beat Miami? Yeah, I do remember that. Remember when Miami beat Dallas the first time, though? You remember that? You remember when you couldn't so much as breathe on Dwayne Wade? And it not be an and one? You remember that? <laughs> you remember Dwayne Wade putting 40 points on that ass every night? <laughs> you remember that? Although it did hurt when, when the Heat lost to the Mavericks. That was not cool. LeBron was just a super little baby bag bitch for that series. Like, he just disappeared, man. Otherwise, who knows what could have happened with that Heat team. Oh, listen. Dallas is happy regardless. I'm happy Dirk Nowitzki got a championship because that guy's just too good to not have one. You know what I'm saying? Glad he did it with, for his team too without him having to like go somewhere else to do it. That's starting to become the thing. There's really no more uh, developing players and winning championships through the draft and blah, blah, blah. Unless you're the Heat, you know, that that's kind of what we do. We develop players. You know what I'm saying? Marvin Williams for the Hornets to 99. Unless, of course, there's a key, more key, you know, free agent out there than Pat Riley going to make moves. Because, you know, we got the Godfather at the, at the, the head of the chair. You know what I'm saying? Head of the table, I should say. Russell Westbrook for the Thunder to 2017. That's another scary team right there. Which reminds me. I know it's it's not real life, but I was playing 2K with my homeboy the other day. And uh, mind you, I haven't played 2K in like over 2 years now. I'm kind of I'm kind of boycotting 2K in my own personal way. I'm boycotting them. I'm just, I'm not a fan of the whole my career thing they're doing now. Like, I'm, in the microtransactions, I'm, I'm not a fan. TJ Leaf for the Pacers with the auto. That's a nice auto right there. But, uh, anyways. I forgot what team he picked, but he picked, like, one of the top teams in the league. I, I think it was either the Rockets or the Thunder or some shit like that. 
And I have picked the Heat because I always play with the Heat. Always. Vince Carter for the Kings to 199. Right? So I picked the Heat. I think the Heat are ranked maybe like 15th overall on 2K with the Raptors updated. Rosters updated or whatever, right? And I whooped that boy by like 20 something points. And mind you, we play on Hall of Fame around here, baby. So I whooped that ass. And I continue to whoop it two straight times because, you know. Oh, no, I'm in the game cheating, dog. Let me get the rematch. Okay. Whip that ass again. And the third time, he kind of got close. You know, he got a little close. It was like a five-point game. But still, whipped it. And I did it with the heat each time. So it begs the question, how good are the heat? I know it's video games. I just like to, you know, I even when I played Madden, I would do that. I would always play with the Dolphins. So the Dolphins are winning championships virtually. And I'm like, look, man, if we could do this on a video game, why can't we do it in real, you know, whatever. Sammy Ojaleye for the Celtics. He's been uh, getting some good minutes, too. He's been playing very well. Uh, a lot of players have been playing pretty well in Gordon Hayward's absence out there for Boston. Jalen Brown also getting really good minutes. The Celtics came back and beat the Thunder the other day. I don't remember seeing that on Sports Center. It was. It might have been on a night where the Heat lost. If the Heat or the Dolphins lose, I don't watch Sports Center for like a week, unless it's basketball. Then you know I don't watch it for like a couple days. Because, you know, when they start talking about my team, or when they don't talk about my team, it, it, it upsets me. Anyways. For the Sixers. Justin Anderson. With the auto. Yeah, not when it's the Dolphins. I barely watch Sports Center. I'll only watch like you know highlights here and there on YouTube or whatever. Honestly, you know I don't have cable at home, but you know thanks to my friends, I have like all the apps and their passwords for them, like Netflix, Hulu, HBO, etc., etc., ESPN included, so I can watch TV on my phone. I just rather watch it like on YouTube in like a short format, so I have to dedicate you know more of my time to it than I should. Uh, to 2017, Paul Millsap of the Hawks. I don't know if that makes any sense to you. Like I would rather just watch. I just want to watch the Heat highlights. So I'm gonna go watch the Heat highlight. Yeah, my Miami Dolphins did not kick ass. We got our ass. We didn't really get our ass kicked. We, we kick back, which is nice to see. You know, we put up a little fight. You know, it's just, it's a shame, man, because we got a good defense. Like, we got a good defense. We just can't put up any points, man. And we put up some points last night. Yeah, whatever. But, like, we couldn't get the points when we needed them. You know, I remember there was a point in the fourth quarter where, you know, we were down by four. But the defense came, you know, came up huge with a turnover, and we could not score. We were in good, we had good field position, and we couldn't drive and score. And I think we had like five, six minutes left in the game. You know, the good teams win those games. The elite teams, you know, win those games. Dolphins are just nowhere near that level we're a mediocre team we are the epitome of a mediocre team i did see parker's catch though uh brandon it's not just hoops tonight uh we also have phoenix at nine o'clock yeah parker's catch was sick as hell it kind of reminded me of odell's catch uh but yeah, i'm glad to see him back on the field man that guy that guy's a that guy's a stud they put in work. I know they put in work. Like, Kenyon Drake had some nice runs, man. But 
Uh, Jerry, uh, I'm not sure, honestly. I don't think all base cards ship. Uh, I don't think veteran base ships. Uh, it is in the description, buddy. Uh, Brandon, it is on eBay. Uh, it breaks at 9 o'clock. I'm not sure if there are steel, steel, if there are still teams available for auction or whatever. You know, considering I have my hands full right now, I can't really check. But, uh, Jerry, to answer your question, I do believe it's in the description of the listing. Um, but off the top of my dome, I think Jason changed it so that veteran base does not ship. Let me just check my myself now. Ah, so you can't even... Alright, so I just checked. Uh, Brandon, I don't believe you can uh, bid on any more Phoenix teams. Yeah, well, at least for, for Hoops Break number 3, so I'm just going to assume... Yeah, Brandon, I just checked just now, and it's not up there. Uh, only the Hoops basketball, and it's, and it's a, a few teams at that. Not a few, but you know... There's teams available for that. Uh, only hoops on eBay anyway. And on the website as well while I'm at it. Although I do have different things on the on the website. I also have archives baseball, immaculate soccer. I believe I have personals for five star two. But as far as the Dolphins, I do like what I saw this Sunday. Not a fan of all the penalties. That really killed us. I think we if we had half those penalties, we probably would have been in a better position to win that game. Um but I do like what I saw. Uh, you know, the effort was there. You know, just a lot of mental mistakes, a lot of just mediocrity, man. That's, that's, what, that's what we got. That's what we got. Uh, no, Brandon, no. <laughs> I love how you, like... Oh man, that's hilarious. Thank you for the laugh. That that was a genuine laugh. Kyrie Irving. Uh what? Kyrie Irving to nine 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 for the Cavs. I thought it was dumb as well, John, but I will say this, man. Uh the coach is just not having it. You know, any player that's a distraction or, you know, whatever, got to go. Uh, Derek White of the Spurs to 99 right there. So that that's what I feel like it came down to with the Jai. Like, it was never made public, but I feel like internally there was some kind of strife there. Like, you know what I'm saying? There was some kind of issue to the point where they couldn't settle it, you know, between them or whatever. And it just... It's, it's obviously been an ongoing issue because, you know, some of you may not remember this, but the very first game of last year, uh, Jay Ajayi didn't even travel with the team to Seattle because of it was some disciplinary thing there. So, you know, this goes back to, to his very first season with us, you know. But I will say I'm happy for him. Because he had a great season for us last year. You know, he was one of our... I think we only had, like, two pro bowlers last year. And he was one of them. You know, he really did have a great season. Uh, not so much this year. A lot of that can be uh, pointed towards the O-line for the Dolphins and our play calling, etc. So I'm glad he's playing for a good team. Uh, one of the best teams, if not the best team right now in the league. Uh, Marco Soul there, 2017, for the Grizzlies. Uh, any word on the hoops on the site? Uh, well, the word is I have 17 teams left. And uh, once I'm done with this hoops break, I'm going to try to get that thing filled up. 
uh, via filler. I agree. J.J. is definitely in the top 10 of the running backs. Top 5, top 6. I do agree with that statement. So I feel like the Dolphins did that because, you know, they kind of knew they weren't going anywhere. Like That's kind of what it seems like to me. kind of seems like we gave up on the season. And right now we're just seeing what we got, trying to establish a culture, and uh, keep it moving. John Collins for the Hawks with the autograph. That's a good. That's a good one for the Hawks right there. We got an insert for Kevin Durant. Hoop sucks. Don't say that. There's been some nice. I've pulled some really nice stuff out of hoops. I've pulled just about every top pick for the Wizards. Chris McCullough. With the auto. It's not planned on the website, Brandon. Uh, as soon as I sell out all the teams, that's when I break it on the website. Uh, so uh, what I was saying was I'm going to run a filler for it. Uh, throw a discount in there and see if we can get that thing breaking tonight. Auto Porter for the Wizards to 2017. Oh, Josh Jackson is not in hoops? Well, that is alarming. Really? That explains why I haven't seen one yet. I just figured it was a really tough pull. Blake Griffin to 199 for the Clippers. Uh, sorry about that, Ken. You know, don't be mad at me if I pull some biscuit action. You know how I do. And that is it for the break. Uh, no, Kian, everything is going to ship tomorrow. Uh, Julie's been putting in crazy overtime. And uh, I have as well. So has Jason, man. We, we were sorting over the weekend. Uh, and I will be sorting again tonight. So everything is going to ship tomorrow. We're pretty much caught up, honestly. There's a... Not too many big breaks there to sort. Uh, I think there's maybe three or four, two or three 400 count box breaks to do, which will take about an hour or two. So we will have everything shipped out tomorrow. Uh, Abe is not Abe does does not do any kind of uh, sorting at all. CBJ talked about throwing on eBay last night. Oh, you mean the rest of the teams? Yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. He, we do that sometimes. You know, he has a great agent. You know, he has a one agent. Uh, do you send emails to whatever winners receiving the breaks? Uh, no, Misha. That's why you gotta watch the videos, man. All right, recap time. Chris McCullough, Wizards. John Collins, Hawks. Justin Anderson, Sixers. T.J. Lee, Pacers. Marcus Page, Hornets. O.G. Anunobi, Raptors. D'Angelo Russell, Nets. Dwayne Bacon, Hornets. Joel Embiid, Sixers. That's a good card. And Sandarius Thornwell. That's a pretty crazy auto for the Clippers right there. And that was the break. That was 2017-18 Panini NBA Hoops Basketball. Five box quarter case break number two eBay style. Thank you very much, guys. We'll get it out to you.